lamb to the slaughter. And in the other room, Mary Maloney began to laugh. The men became silent. Why would she laugh? The husband died a couple hours ago. One of the policemen said, I think the murder weapon is right under our nose. Mary grabbed a knife from the drawer and walked to the policeman and said, If somebody lays a hand on me, I will kill everyone. She ran away and opened the door. There were two policemen who were standing guard if something went wrong. Mary made a quick excuse by saying that a murderer was in the house. The men quickly went inside. Mary locked the door behind her. Then she heard that the men were knocking heavily on the door. She was scared. She knew she would go to prison if they grabbed her. Then she heard the men saying, Mary, open the door. They will not arrest you. She was silent for a minute. Could she trust them? Could she believe a word that I said? Or would she run away, run as fast as she could, and leave everything behind? Or she could grab the police car and drive off, and go somewhere where nobody knows her. But then, before she could do something, one of the policemen jumped out of the glass window and tried to grab her. She ran to the alley, but it was a dead end. The other man came and grabbed her. Then she woke up in her bed, with her husband in front of her, getting ready to leave. She stood up and hugged her husband. She cried and said, I thought you were dead. I killed you. Mr. Maloney began to giggle. Why would you kill me? I must have did something horrible. Mrs. Melody said, you were trying to divorce me and leave me and the baby behind. Mr. Maloney responded, I will never do that, darling. I love you. I love you with all my heart. But darling, I have to go to work now. Shall we have lamb for supper? Or do I need it to buy it on the way home? Or we could eat somewhere. I know a place. It's about two miles from home. I heard from a lot of people that the fruit was delicious. Mrs. Maloney responded, Of course, darling, that would be fantastic. Mr. Maloney said, All right, darling, I will book a table for us, but I will have to go to work now, otherwise I will be late. Goodbye, darling. The end.